Knock, knock. <laughs> <laughs> knock, knock, I said. Who's that? I don't know. It's not my door. <laughs> <laughs> That's what you call a knock, knock joke. It, it's a joke. That means it's funny. All my mates said I should be a stand-up comedian. Always up for a laugh, me. First of all, then, I've got to get the, the stand-up bit right. Okay. I'm a bit wobbly right now. But I'll get there. The doctor says I'm making marvellous progress, considering. He doesn't know I'm here, though. He told me I wasn't allowed to go out on my own. But sod it. There's a, a door round the back that they keep unlocked because they use it for their fag breaks. So I slipped out there. Well, don't worry. I'm not dangerous. I'm not an utter. I'm, I'm just not all there. You know? I was there last Sunday, though up at the cathedral they got us a minibus and we all stood to attention as they played the last post some of us did anyway it felt it felt good to be back on parade I can't remember their names. The blokes I was with. But it felt like the old days. Remembrance Day. Now that is a joke for me. I mean, I can just about remember my own name most days. And how many sugars do I take it on take in my tea? I know that like the back of my hand. I've got it written there. <laughs> I'm, I'm, I'm just not all there. That's all. Not these days. <laughs> I can't even remember what I came in here for. <laughs> That doesn't really matter, <coughs> does it? I'm here. I'm out. I remember them though, all right. My mates. Ginger. He was a Geordie. Always going on and on about Newcastle United. And how, how he hated soft southerners. Which I... Th thought was odd because his best mate was Smudge from Peckham. <laughs> then there was Aslock, Belcher from Sidmouth, Gaza from St Thomas and me from Sidwell Street. I even joined up at the recruiting office up the road. I can see their faces now, as clear as I see you. Come Saturday, we'd all be desperate to find out how the Grecians had got on. As often as not, they'd be useless, of course, but it didn't matter. We'd be moaning about the manager or, or one of the players, and it would be just like being in the pub back at home. Well... <laughs> Not exactly like the pub, of course. You don't get many RPGs and bullets flying around the Duke of York. <laughs>
Knock, knock. Knock, knock. Who's that? Who's that? I don't know. It's not my door. <laughs> Where was I? Oh, yeah. My mate. We were due to be sent back home in a couple of days. But that doesn't mean anything. You can't think about that when you're out there. It makes you nervous. It feels like the odds are running down against you. We were part of a patrol that had to clear a compound. It was like a small farm. Just a collection of buildings. There was nothing on the way in. No fire. We took it carefully though. Then the sergeant moved us forward. A five-man team. Geordie, Smudge, Gazza, Belcher and me. We were in a ditch and the wall of the nearest building was about 30 yards away, but over open ground. We ran, and as we ran, I remember looking at the line of dust my boots were kicking up. We hit the wall and uh, took position. Still no firing. We edged our way towards the door, and the stripe me, I mean the sergeant, pointed at me. I readied my gun and the other guys got ready to rush in after me. Knock knock. The sergeant knocked on my helmet twice. I moved out and kicked the door in. That's about all I remember. There was a flash, a roar, a heat uh, and pain, and then there were shots and shouting, and, and and then I woke up in a field hospital in Camp Bastion in Hellman, and then I was here. The blast ripped off my right leg and half my torso. A lump of metal burned through my helmet into my head. I broke all my ribs and I had a collapsed lung. The doctor said... The The doctor says it's brain damage. That's why I can't remember much anymore. I did better than Geordie though. They had to scrape him up, Smudge says. Flew him back in a box. I've just remembered why I came in to buy a puppy. I lost mine. Knock knock. I don't know. It's not my door.